Michelle just showed up in LA to try to bully her way into Melania's role, blows up in her face, the only time Michelle Obama seems to detour from vacation is to try to reclaim her former role that she's having a hard time relinquishing to Melania Trump. Her inability to let her former life as First Lady go has been on full display ever since Melania moved into the position. This was especially the case this week when she showed up in Los Angeles and tried to reclaim control by taking over when it suddenly blew up in her face with what Melania did. The last time Michelle showed her face it was when she showed up unexpectedly in Italy, where Donald and Melania had stopped on their first overseas trip. The former first lady shocked with her heinous fashion sense when she arrived at a historic Catholic cathedral dressed for a night at the club. She resurfaced in Los Angeles this week, thinking she would grace the stage with her presence and message at the Apple Worldwide Developers Conference when the real first lady stood up and outclassed Michelle with what she did. Michelle had been invited to speak at the conference which was a surprising decision since this woman doesn't have much wisdom to impart on others as she proved the second she opened her mouth. Rather than using her time, which she was presumably paid for, to say something thought-provoking, she decided to spend it trashing President Trump. For someone who can't even make something as simple as school lunch edible for kids, Michelle thought she was qualified to criticize Trump over global warming junk science and his temporary travel ban from failed Islamist states, the Gateway Pundit pointed out. I think my message earlier was, you know, think about that higher purpose. Because we are at a time in this country when we need problem solvers out there who are committed who believe in this country who believe in the value of diversity and believe in, you know, the value of immigrants, and believe that global warming is real, Michelle said in her speech. It's really hard to take this woman seriously when she says that global warming is real, after leaving a massive carbon footprint everywhere she goes with a fleet of aircraft to accommodate her travel demands. There was much more that Michelle said on stage which only the people physically there in attendance could hear since she insisted on a media blackout of her convention speech, except for the slanderous things she said about our president. While she was on stage attempting to make her husband's predecessor look like far less of a leader than he was, considering that she has nothing else to offer for the price she's paid to speak, her effort immediately blew up in her face. Prior to this speech, Melania showed an exceptional level of class and appreciation for her fellow Americans with a press release she had prepared for what was going to take place the same night as Michelle's slander mission. This evening at the White House, President Donald J. Trump and First Lady Melania Trump, along with Lt. Gen. H.R. McMaster and retired General and current Secretary of Homeland Security John Kelly, hosted a reception to honor Gold Star families and those they have lost, the official White House release read, from the office of the First Lady. Gold Star families have lost an immediate family member who was serving during wartime, and they are a unique and distinct category of individuals who should be cherished, First Lady Melania Trump said, according to the release. These families have endured the ultimate in pain and sacrifice on behalf of our country, and I am honored to have spent the evening with them. My husband and I commit to always pay tribute to our active service military, veterans, and the families who love them say Melania Trump POTUS and I paid personal tribute to hashtag Gold Star Families tonight at White House. Thank you to all the brave men and women who have fought for our freedom. It's poetic justice that at the exact same time that Michelle was publicly ripping our president apart for his alleged divisiveness and ignorance, Melania was showing what a real first lady looks like. By preparing this press release about some of the most important people in our country the ones who gave their lives for the land of the free and the families who are without these heroes this immigrant turned flotus showed her genuine patriotism and appreciation for the ultimate sacrifice that Barack and Michelle Obama took for granted. This couple can keep shadowing the real president and his wife trying to reclaim the spotlight everywhere they go, but all that is showing is Americans made the right decision in replacing them in November. The Obamas can't stand that someone is getting the country back on track after they tried their hardest to dismantle it for eight years. Please do not forget like on videos and subscribe and comment because your voice matters and visit our page on Facebook and like them and follow up. And thanks for watching.